Hey, what is going on guys? Jolts here, and I'm live with another video, and today we're going to be doing an uh, armory run on Roland. Uh, normally people farm on Lilith, and I find that kind of, you know, repetitive. I see that at like every video, so we're going to be doing Roland today. Um, so our goal is to get a pearl, so we're going to go try to go fast and see what happens. Oops, background noise, sorry about that. Alright, uh, if you throw your grenade at the bar of the turret, you actually duplicate it and get big jumps. And it only works with the longbow, too, by the way. Alright. Uh, so I'm going to focus on only the lance chest because I don't want to sit there and farm everything. Uh, it would take forever because, like I said, my goal is to get a pearl. And, yeah, if we don't get it, then I'll go ahead and cut forward to the part where we get it. You know, farming, I don't know, craw or something like that. Uh, I think we'll farm craw, to be honest. Yeah. Because normally the armory pearls are kind of not that special. But getting it from craw is kind of like... You know, it's more satisfying, I would say. Like seeing it drop from his dead body. Anyways, uh, so let's keep going here. There's a chest up here. I'm going to grab it. Normally, I wouldn't do it with anybody else, but with Roland, you can grenade jump or super grenade jump. So I will grab that. Slowly driving along. Yeah, so I know a lot of people hate this DLC for the driving, but... You know, it, it's kind of like a, a cost, and there's a reward for it. So you do the drive, you get a reward. Alright. Check these guys out, make sure they don't kill me. Alright, should be okay. So we're going to throw a turret down and throw the grenade at the bar of the turret, and it should duplicate, and I bump my head. Oops. Redo. There we go. Chest over here, we'll grab that. Hopefully first try. Probably not. Always room for nah, bullets. go figure. Alright, keep going. Car's way over there. I went a little too far. Not a big deal. So I probably will kill Ajax on the way too because, you know, I know the Ajax Ogre isn't a pearl, but it would be cool to get one of those or see it drop. Yeah, this DLC is a lot of driving. Um, I wish there was more to do when you drive there. Uh, there's a few chests and enemies and stuff like that, but for the most part, it's a pretty, you know, straightforward drive. But the reward at the end is definitely worth it. Wow, I actually made that. Didn't flip my car. Alright, keep going here. Next map, we'll make it to Craw. Or no, Craw's in this map. Yeah, right. What was I thinking? All right, so uh, for Roland, we have our heavy gunner com on because that is one of his most OP class mods. And the heavy gunner is going to boost their damage by 42%, the one I have. Uh, and if I get a kill skill, I get Metal Storm, which is going to give you a lot more uh, fire rate too. So I definitely recommend it if you're playing Roland. All right, we didn't get trolled. Sometimes the enemies can spawn on top of your car and like destroy it, which kind of sucks. But it didn't happen. Thank goodness. Alright, made it. Now, Crawl isn't too bad on Merland. Uh It takes a little bit of luck, but we're going to do the ledge glitch. Um, as per usual, because I don't really like to fight Crawl legit unless you're doing Lilith, because she can run away and heal and stuff like that. But for Roland, you have no movement speed except for grenade jumping. And, um, you know, it makes the fight a lot more difficult. Check the vendors. Eh, nothing good. Nope. Alright, wait for this. Oh, this elevator is so slow too. Like, I can understand if you die in a fight, you have to redo the elevator. And, you know, it's slow and it takes time. It's kind of like a uh, penalty. But for the first time you're going up there, I don't think it should be taking that long to get the elevator. Or the lift, whatever you want to call it. So we do have our Unforgiven Masher. Um, it's one of the most OP uh, DPS items in this game. It does a lot of damage. You can one-shot its limbs. Uh, so we will use that. And I have the Orion here in case a Craw Maggot charges me. Hopefully not. I see one way back there. Alright. 
Gonna jump there, make it a little bit faster. Ah, all right, kill him first. Cool. To the corner. Oh, it was two. All right, that's good. And yeah, now you can just do this. And now I shoot and reload because I want to wait for the crosshairs to reset. Make the shots a little more accurate. And from what, what I heard too is uh, it makes your fire rate a little bit faster. Go for the eye. That was quick. All right. So now Jackal, we're going to aim straight up, start shooting it, and aim down slowly. And we're going to switch over to the Bessie and hopefully get the critical hit bonus transferred on the Jackal. Awesome. Easy. Wow, that was a good run. Uh, that could take a few tries, but anyways, when the pellets come down and you're holding the Bessie, uh, the 500% critical hit bonus applies to the um, Jackal shots. All right, Mongol. I don't see a pearl, sadly. Bulldog. Equalizer. Go figure. You get those like every run. Alright. Well, a whole lot of nothing. Hopefully the armory has something. Uh, we could run back and, you know, uh, click the button, but it's a little bit faster to do it this way, and I don't mind doing this. You lose a little bit of money, but not a big deal. At end game, you have so much money. All right, so to the armory. And grenade jump more because Roland has no movement speed bonuses, sadly. Grab a cart. Uh, you gotta be careful here. You don't wanna boost the whole way down, otherwise you'll uh, fly off the edge. All right, so we're gonna super grenade jump over to the chest. It's a lot faster. There we go. All right, come on, Pearl. Help. Nope. And like I said, I'm only going for a Pearl. I don't care about the other chest. All right, so when lifts are moving upwards, uh, it can be an elevator or this thing or whatever. Uh, when you throw a grenade straight down, it's going to actually duplicate and give you a big jump, uh, which is pretty cool. And you can see that we made it pretty easy. Yeah, and it only works on the longbow sing or not singularity. Wow. It works on the longbow um, grenade only. And it is a low level, so it doesn't kill me either. Also, we have the lost loot mission open. Uh, we didn't complete it, so we can farm a few more chests on the way. And why do I have this car? What the heck? I didn't change it. I must have. Yeah, whoops. Alright, respawn. There we go. So if you pick up the mission Lost Loot and you don't complete it, like you can open the chest but don't complete it, then you can actually find these chests over and over. All right, we got guns over here. Okay, nothing. All right, let's go over here. All right, Drifter. Now they can drop pearls too, but I find them kind of a pain to farm on Roland. Uh, if I was a Lilith, maybe I'd farm them, but I don't want to sit there and, like, you know, deal with them. Nope. Because they can destroy your cars, too. And that's pretty annoying. Alright, to uh, Ajax. Take it right here. He probably won't drop it, but um, if he does, that'd be pretty cool. And we have the Orion for this because it does so much damage. Melts his shield. Nope, didn't get it. Cut the spear. Oh well. Keep going here. To the armory. Around this corner. Uh, there are a few enemies that can drop pearls. Um, there's defenders and some certain rocketeers stuff like that uh, if i do see one of them on the way i will kill them to try to get the pearl uh you never know could happen but it's like extremely rare all right don't take the jump because uh sometimes you go off off the cliff wow nice flip all right switch over to the defiler just in case a little bit safer 
Because these guys can do a lot of damage. They can spawn with some really nasty stuff. Alright, so far so good. And we stay up here because it's a little bit safer. Uh, they don't really chase you as hard. Cool. And we'll super grenade jump too. Why not? Ah, fail. Oh well. Now there is a chest around this corner. Um, it can spawn a crimson shorty. But it didn't, okay. If it faces a different direction, it has the shorty, but this time it didn't. So he's gonna be up ahead. Ooh man, he's got chalk. Really hurts. Okay. Keep going. Alright, no chest there, so it's gonna be around the corner. Alright. And it could be a shock trooper or um, defender up here. Yeah, this guy. And they can drop pearls, apparently, so I'm gonna kill them. I've seen video proof, so I know it does um, actually happen. Alright, nothing. Chemical trooper. Ah, okay. So we're gonna go Orion. Oh, background noise. Sorry. Man, they really hurt. So much HP. There we go. Rocketeer, basic one. He won't drop anything. Nope, nothing. Alright, so this chest has the Crimson Shorty. So we'll get ready for him. Nothing. Oh well. So they can't actually drop legendaries too. Um, they're not like a loot midget, but they can spawn with the legendary weapon and drop it. And the cool thing about them is they're level 69. So when they kill, when you kill them, they drop the 69 item too. Uh, because the only way to get level 69 like legendaries and stuff is to get it from the item of the day from the vendor, or from like uh, an enemy or something like that. And I've had a few. I've had uh, hellfires and equalizers, stuff like that. From uh, the shorties. Alright, so Nox is actually really easy. We're gonna go Chopper. And the Chopper is underestimated. Like, it does so much damage. You'll see here in a second. Alright, grenade jump. So Chopper plus Heavy Gunner com uh, Heavy Gunner com equals this. Yeah. Look at its HP. Melting away. And you are dead. Ah, missed the gold. Oh well. Uh, the gold sells for a lot of money. Yeah, so if you want to get the chopper, you got to farm Motorhead. Uh, you get that mission from that midget from uh, the Sunken Sea. I forget his name. Thirsty, that's his name. Yeah. Alright, so we're doing a glitch. We're going to go ahead and fall in here. Not solid. There we go. You have to have the final mission active to do that glitch, to uh, fall through the floor. Alright, nothing. Loot. Only going for Lance chest. Alright. This will help. Oh, huh, Guardian. I don't care for it too much. It has ammo regen, which is cool. Alright, now we'll go over here. This is where the majority of the uh, chests are. Alright, nothing. Uh, the cool thing about this lift is you can hit the buttons from the backside too. Makes it a little bit faster. Except for the uh, down one. Well, uh, nothing so far. Might be a redo. Nope. Lack of, um, legendaries, too. Sadly. Oh, like I said. Wow. Redemption. Alright, nothing. So, basically, I just want to show you guys how I kind of do my run. Uh, it might help you improve your run a little bit. Uh, or not. Maybe your run is a little bit better than mine. I have no idea. Uh, but this is how I do it.
Hmm. Grenades, take those. For uh, grenade jumping. Nope. Go over here, grenade jump over. It's a bit faster. Grab this. Oh, Sarkov. I don't care for that too much. Uh, fast reload, but low damage. Notice that there was a hole in the floor. Um, you can fall down below to the armory. Uh, it doesn't like take you to like a secret area or nothing, but it's in case you fall in there on accident, you can get out. Kind of funny. All right, down we go. Probably missed the lift. Yeah, gotta wait. Dude, I love the chopper. It might be one of my favorite weapons for this game. Actually, it probably might be. So much damage. I think it's six ammo per shot, or maybe four. I forget. Uh, I throw the turret down for All grenade right. regen. Because I'm specced into, I think it's called stockpile. Oh, fail of a jump. I right, quickly made it. Whew. I hate it when you miss the left, so you gotta sit there and wait for the, the next round. Yep, gotta wait. Uh, they can't crush you either, by the way. Alright, only a few more. Hopefully we get something. This'll help. Not looking good. Nope. So if we don't get anything this run, I'm gonna go ahead and farm Craw. I've seen uh, pearls from the armory quite a bit. Uh, they're more satisfying to get them from Craw, so I'll probably farm him. All right, two more. Hopefully something. Nope. And... Ah. Uh, all right, let's cut forward. All right, so long story short, I farmed over 60 runs on Roland, did not get a single pearl. Uh, so I switched over to Lilith to make it a little more efficient. And you can see here, crawl faces the right side, use phase walk, that's gonna lock him in place, uh, and expose his back. Uh, go into this corner. And as you can see there, his back's pretty exposed. We'll one shot it with the Bessie. Uh, the Bessie and the Spectrecom is very OP. As you can see here, you can one shot his limbs. Uh, if you don't have the Bessie, you can always go for the Skull Masher and one shot his limbs, but you need a uh, Skull Masher with really high base damage. And you can see here, Lilith makes really fast and easy work of it. And an Unforgiven Masher for the eye, because the hitbox is a little bit weird on that for sniping. And there you have it. Easy, fast kill. And you'll see here on the left side, this is post-commentated by the way, uh, we finally got the pearl. I commentated probably uh, 40 of the runs, maybe, maybe like 30 of them, and I got really tired of it, so uh, post-commentary for this one. And you can see here we got the Serpents, and the Serpents is actually pretty cool on Roland. Uh, sadly, it was a really bad one, 4.5 rate of fire, but uh, you know, it is a pearl, I'll take it. And I did get a lot of other drops during these runs. So I will uh, make a montage out of that. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And of course, if you did, please be sure to leave a like because that'd be epic. And I will see you later. Peace out. Yeah. yeah.